Hey loves, a lot of you guys wanted to see an updated retwist video and also wanted to know whether I still use some of the same hair products from my last retwist lock video. So here we go. I did change what shampoos I used from the last video that you guys saw and I'm using Neutrogena Anti-Residue Shampoo to clean and loosen up any product buildup as well as I'm using Shimmer Lights Shampoo to help brighten up my natural grays. After I've shampooed my hair, I like to apply Talia YG's African Healing Oil all over my damp hair before styling. I love this oil, it's very lightweight on the hair and it smells really good. Plus, this one bottle usually can last me anywhere up to 8 months to a year. The one question that I get asked on a regular is, do I still use Empress Lock and Slay? Yes, you guys, it's the only hair product that I use for my retwist. A matter of fact, I love it so much that I've ordered three bottles of this product in case another pandemic occurred. One bottle is about $17 or so, but I got three for $35, which is a deal for me, and I could not pass it up. I typically try to stay away from gels and waxes to help eliminate any product buildup that can accumulate over a period of time. So this lightweight spray is everything right now for me. Not much of my routine has changed. I still use the same palm roll method when doing my retwist. I still use all the same hair products except for the Dr. Bronner's 2-in-1 Hemp Peppermint Soap. I don't dislike the product, but I just found something else that works better for me. My retwisting time generally takes about two hours to complete, 
and my retweets can last anywhere from one to two weeks before the fuzziness starts to set in except for the nape of my neck because I tend to sweat the most there. I like to use a small amount of wild growth hair oil after a retwist around my sensitive areas on my scalp like down the middle and on the right side of my head where the hair seems to be finer than the rest. In my last retwist video, I just hit the six month mark into my lock journey. Currently, I'm two years and two months locked, but my routine and the products that I use are pretty much still the same. Anyways guys, let me know what y'all think of this video in the comment section down below. And I will see you all in the next video. Until next time, you guys. Bye-bye.